There they are. We're really screwed now. Our fusion time ran out. We're gonna get killed, aren't we? Might not be able to do much, but I'll join in as well. We'll go down fighting, giving it our all. <laughs> Energy. Someone's coming. Gohan's triumphant return. It's my brother! My brother's here! Thank goodness. I made it. Gohan! My brother's here! He wasn't dead after all! Whoa, that's Gohan? There's something different about his energy. He seems more confident. Maybe that could be why I didn't recognize him. Where's everyone else? They're gone. Majin Buu killed them all. Even Mom? And Dende? Yeah, we're the only ones left. <laughs> they were yummy. I ate every last one of them. They make good chocolate. No, he's wrong. It's faint, but I can sense some key. <sighs> Don't tell me you're going to fight me. No, I'm going to kill you. Majin Buu. I will not. I... I will not let you do this! I will not! I will not! I will not! Thinking, Gohan. Thanks. Sure. I can't believe he blew himself up. So is Boo... dead? No. Then what happened? Did he run away? I can't feel his energy anymore. He has the power to mask his key. He's hiding and waiting for his chance to attack! Uh, I'm not sure about that. But it did seem like he was up to something. If he is 
is alive, he's not gonna be for much longer. <laughs> that guy could barely lay a finger on Gohan. I'd say he was about as strong as our Super Gotenks. He was stronger. Oh, yeah? Hmm. Maybe a little bit. That reminds me, Gohan. Where the hell did you get all this power? Whoa, that old man sounds pretty cool. What about the dragon radar? Who has it? Oh, right. I have it with me. But with Dende gone, the Dragon Balls, they're pretty useless. No, they're not. Dende's still alive. His key's faint, but you can still feel it, right? What? Oh, yeah, you're right. Let's go and meet up with him. I'm picking up a small amount of key from someone else. What? Close. I can barely feel his key. Huh? Is that a person? Yeah. That's. Hey, it's Mr. Satan! You mean he wasn't killed with everyone else? There's no killing that guy, huh? Let's just leave him here. No. I think we better take him with us. I've been watching him from Kami's lookout. He's a good person deep down. In his own clumsy way, he actually tried to save everyone. Dende, you're alive. So glad to see you. M Mr. Popo! He threw me down here before Majin Buu could kill me. We owe Mr. Popo a lot. Thanks to his quick thinking, we have a chance. Hey, uh, what's wrong with the kid? His face is all green. Kid? What do you mean, kid? He's the guardian of Earth. Huh? The, the guardian? Something's not right. What is he up to? Hey, you little runts! Come over here! I want us to finish our fight! Huh? What did he say? Oh, no, you don't, Boo. You're still fighting me. <laughs> First, I want to finish the fight with them. Then you and me can fight. Why? Why do you want to fight them first? What happened to all that talk about you wanting to kill me? What's wrong, Monks? Are you scared of me? What? We're not scared of you. Let's mess this guy up for good, Trunks. Now you're talking. Wait, something isn't right here. Don't you find all of this kind of strange? If I could just get that kid's power and that Piccolo guy's brains. What the? No. What do you think, Gohan? Looks like my plan was a huge success. You have just witnessed the birth of the ultimate Marjan! Oh, you dirty slimy. I can't believe you actually absorbed them. You have only yourself to blame. After all, you made the mistake of surpassing me. I've been planning this from the very first time I felt your power, from far away. 
I knew what I had to do. As I fought that super goatee brat, I figured out that absorbing him would make me completely untouchable. But that kid's power had a time limit. He told me so himself. I couldn't have him returning to normal on me, so I bided my time. Gotink said it would take another hour to fuse again, so I lied in wait until then. <laughs> so that's what you were up to. <sighs> you know, if you really wanted to obtain the ultimate power, you should have absorbed me. <laughs> you still don't get it, do you? What's the point if I have no one to rival me? Didn't you hear me when we fought before? I am going to kill you. That's my ultimate goal. Huh, I see. So that's your angle. Makes sense. I'm starting to get bored. Time to finish this! What? No way! Oh, he can't beat him. He's not strong enough. Hmm, I certainly did not see this coming. Well then, that settles it. Goku, you're going to go help him. Huh? Uh, but I can't. That's right, Elder Kai. Goku is no longer able to return to the world of the living. I'm fully aware of that. That's why I'm going to offer him my life. He can then make his way to Gohan. But you're going to give me your life? Are you serious? I can't allow that. If you don't let me, the entire universe is history. Then I'll offer him my life. It's the least I can do to help. That's enough of that. You're still young. Me, on the other hand, I've only got another thousand or so years left. But, Gramps... Farewell, and good luck. <clears throat> Thanks, Gramps. I promise. I'll try not to waste the life you've given me. All right, then get a move on. Hey, now! Don't let my sacrifice be in vain! Uh, right. Okay, I'm out of here. Wait just a second. I forgot something. Take my patara. Wear one on your left ear when you get there. Uh, wait a sec. So wearing this will make me stronger? In a sense, yes. If Gohan wears the other on his right ear, you two will combine into one warrior. What? 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 Are you serious? Yes, and the effect is far stronger than that other fusion technique. 
Those Patara earrings are considered a sacred treasure among the Supreme Kais. Uh, I never knew about that. Hm. You younger generations are truly hopeless. Go on, try it for yourselves. You and Kabito use your own Patara earrings. What? Wow, this power, it's incredible! <laughs> With this power, I can join the fight too! Don't get carried away, you dolt! Neither of you were much on your own, and fusing isn't going to change that. I see. Wow, you weren't kidding, Gramps! That's awesome! Oh yeah! By the way, how long does the fusion last? The Patara don't have a weakness like that. The fusion lasts forever. It's permanent. Huh? Well, as far as I know. <sighs> There's a shock. I'd be fused with Gohan forever? Well, I guess I can live with that. Quit your incessant babbling and get out of here! Do you want Gohan to die? Uh, uh, right. All right, I'm off. Oh, and thanks for everything. I will destroy everyone and everything! Dad, is that you? What are you doing here? Gohan, take this! Huh? Uh, uh. Uh, pick it up, hurry! Put it on your right ear! The two of us are gonna fuse and take Boo down! What? Fuse? Huh? Found it! Uh, what was I supposed to do with it again? Not gonna happen! with Gohan, but it looks like I beat you to it. There's no one left for you to fuse with. Come on, man. Think you're tricky, huh? Absorbing everyone like that? I can't believe this. This energy, it's... it's... What's wrong? Giving up already? Then it's time for you to die! <laughs> Instant transmission! This is as far as I can go! King Yama was kind enough to return your body, but only so you can be here to fight that monster. You do understand that, right? I'll be fine. Whether I'm dead or alive, it makes no difference to me. I'll do what I can. Vegeta! I knew it was you! K Kakarot? Listen up, Vegeta. I need you to wear this on your right ear. We're gonna fuse! No, we aren't. Why the hell would I do that? Because! This is our only shot at beating Majin Buu! I'd rather be erased from existence than become one with the likes of you! Vegeta, forget your pride just this once! The whole universe is done for if we don't do this! You've got some nerve. 
You hid a great deal of your power from me when we last fought, didn't you, Kakarot? What is this Super Saiyan 3? You never cease to piss me off, you know that? I will not fuse with a bastard like you! <sighs> I'm sorry, Vegeta. I can't stay in that form very long. I was saving it for when I really needed it. I don't want to hear your excuses! You disrespected me by holding back. I've never been so humiliated. Maybe this will change your mind then. Everyone's been eaten by Boo! Even Bulma and Trunks! Oh. Boo's on his way here! Please! You want to save them, right? Uh, give it to me, now! There you are! Vegeta, just a heads up. This fusion's permanent. There's no going back after this. Got it? W what did you say? D damn you! Why would you wait until now to tell me that? This is what I'm supposed to do, right? Yep. Thanks, Vegeta. <laughs> Just happened. All right now. Rivals unite against Majin Buu. Since I'm the fusion of Vegeta and Kakarot, I guess that makes me Vegeta. And this is Super Vegito. Ooh, impressive. Come at me! How dare you taunt me! I wish you'd take this seriously! Who do you think you are? for you to take this seriously. <laughs> uh. 
All right, I'm starting to get bored, so let's go ahead and end this. I'll give you until the count of ten. Say your prayers if you've got any. One. Two. Three. Four. <sighs> what are you doing? Now's your chance. Come on. You've only got one move left when you're in this kind of position. At this rate, my only option is to absorb him. But how? Oh. Wait, that's it. I can use the part of me that he cut off earlier. Seven. Eight. So he finally figured it out. It's about time. This is the whole reason I cut off that ridiculous tail thing on his head. Very good. He's not paying attention. Nine! All right. Time to see if this is going to work. Ten! Now! There he is! I did it! I did it! <laughs> this can't be happening! He was absorbed! It's over now! No, it might not be. Huh? Doesn't something seem a little odd to you? When he absorbed someone before, not only did his power increase, but his appearance changed. And now, something's different. He hasn't changed at all. What does this mean? It's possible Vegeta was absorbed by Majin Buu on purpose. Well, isn't he a crafty one? To commemorate my newfound dominance, I'll destroy this planet! Look, something's happening! I knew it! I knew it! He went into Boo to find a way to save his friends! What? This can't be happening! There he is! What are you doing? He's returning to his previous forms. What? What in the world? We did it! Everyone's back to normal! We need to hide them. Boo still hasn't noticed us yet. <sighs> All right, I'm heading back to where Boo is. Right. All right, Gohan and the others should be okay now. Who still isn't budging? Guess we'd better keep a close eye on him then. Hey! Something's happening to Boo!
Uh, wait a sec, Vegeta. Is it just me, or is his energy increasing? It's not possible. He's reverting back. Reverting back? What do you mean? The Majin Buu that Bibidi created was evil incarnate, something even he himself couldn't control. It wasn't until the mild-mannered Grand Supreme Kai was absorbed that Bibidi could finally control him. So, what you're saying is, this little Boo now is even more of a handful than what we've been dealing with? Yes. Absorbing others had a dampening effect on him, but now, now his evil is unrestrained. He's lost all self-control and is again pure evil. tried to blow the whole planet to pieces. Dang that little bastard. Hey, Boo! Go ahead and destroy the planet if you want. But you'll have to go through us first. There's no way we can knock that thing back. The others! Vegeta, over here! I'm gonna get us all out of here! Yeah! Grab onto me! It's no use! We're not gonna make it! I can't use instant transmission fast enough! Hey! Well done! You made it! Yeah, we did. But Gohan and the others... and Earth... Kakarot! What the hell have you done? Why did you bring these fools instead? <laughs> what about Earth? It's gone, I'm afraid. Nothing but space debris now. <laughs> uh, Earth... G gone? <laughs> what are you talking about? We're standing on it. Wait. <laughs> yeah. I know what's going on. This is all a dream. <laughs> yeah, it's just a dream. Damn it, Kakarot. Gohan and the others are all dead because you decided to save this dumbass instead. And now Earth and everyone on it can't be brought back. The Dragon Balls, the only safety net we had, are gone. What? Dragon Balls? Why in the world were there Dragon Balls on Earth? Those are forbidden, powerful objects entrusted to only the Namekians. No one else should possess them. Th that's right. If we head to New Namek, the new Grand Elder should be able to give us access to the new Dragon Balls there. We can't do it. We can bring back Earth and all those killed by Boo. With Planet Namek back, I should be able to teleport between here and other planets with no problem. All right, now we're talking. <gasps> Take a look. Majin Buu's returning to his original shape. <laughs> here, give your Patara to Goku and Vegeta. They should be able to beat him if they fuse again. Uh, uh, right. Nah, we don't need those. Huh? Yeah. 
That type of fusion technique really isn't for us. I want to fight him on my own anyway. Besides, he's not relying on anyone else's power anymore. That's what I like to hear, Kakarot. You're finally talking like a Saiyan. How the hell did he get here? Whoa. I can't believe this. He saw my instant transmission before and copied it. Well, whatever. That saves us some trouble. We'll just end this here, then. Get out of here. Find some faraway planet and take everyone with you. Uh, okay. Oh, right, then. I guess we don't have much of a choice. Pay no mind to this world of ours. Go all out and show that monster what for. Good luck. Uh, oh, no. I forgot to bring that Satan fellow with us. Forget about him for now. All right. Who's going first? Let's find out. Rock, Rock paper, paper, scissors! scissors. Yes, I win! Woohoo! <laughs> At least I'll finally be able to see this Super Saiyan 3 of yours. Yeah! Let's do this, Boo! Hmm? Hey! He's sleeping! Why, you little... Are you messing with me?
really are something else. I think I finally figured it out. I think I know why a genius like me can't keep up with you. I thought it was because you had people you wanted to protect. It was as if having a strong desire to save others gave you some mysterious power. And maybe it does in some way. I too have those I care about now. But you were always different. You don't fight to win. You fight to continue pushing yourself past your own limits. That's why you never took the lives of your opponents. You... You even had the opportunity to kill me. But you didn't. You didn't. Damn you, Kakarot. I can't believe a battle-loving, kind-hearted saint like you even exists. You're in trouble now, Boo. Here comes my full power, Kamehameha! <laughs> Only you can do this. You are number one.